Obituaries for Friday, March 22nd. Gladys Coram Durham, 81, of Eden, died March 21st. Private graveside services will be held. She was born in Rockingham County and was a homemaker. She was preceded in death by husband Cabell Durham and is survived by daughter Cynthia Cindy Durham Broadnax and husband Charles Chucky of Eden, five grandchildren and three great-grandchildren, and brother Fetzer Coram and wife Frances. Boone and Cook Funeral Home is serving the family. Two announcements from Perry Spencer Funeral Homes. The family of Charles Earl Dalton will receive friends today at 1230 in Madison with funeral services at 1, interment at Martin View Primitive Baptist Church Cemetery. A celebration of life for Deborah LaVon Lowe is tomorrow at 12 at St. Thomas Chapel Church, Greensboro. A repast will follow in the Fellowship Hall. Three announcements from Fair Funeral Home. Memorial services for Laura Catherine Wynn are Sunday at 3, visitation at 2, at Moorhead High School Auditorium. She graduated from Moorhead High School, attended Duke University on a full scholarship, and worked at Duke Hospital two years before starting medical school at John Hopkins University. She spent two summers in Africa working on various research projects. Surviving are parents Janet Gunter Wynn and David Wayne Wynn of the home, brother Alex Charles Wynn of Durham, and unbiological sister Sydney Coram. In lieu of flowers, donations may be made to Naomi's Village. Funeral services for Betty Sue Honeycutt are Monday at 1 at First Baptist Church in Eden, with burial at Ridgeview Memorial Gardens. Visitation at 12. She was a native of Drexel, graduated from Appalachian State University with a B.S. degree, and later earned a master's degree in education from the University of North Carolina at Greensboro. Over the span of 27 years, she held teaching positions in Eden, including Burton Grove, Leakesville Graded, and Central Elementary Schools, and served as elementary school supervisor for six years with the Eden City School System. She retired in 1988 with 33 years of educational service. She was a former member of the Junior Woman's Club and Eden Woman's Club volunteered with Meals on Wheels, was a loyal member of various organizations, including Alpha Delta Kappa, an international honor society for women's educa- for women educators, and Rockingham County retired school personnel and Thursday study club. She was a devoted member of First Baptist Church for 70 years. She was preceded in death by husband J.C., They were married 47 years and is survived by sons Bob of Greensboro and Eric of Wake Forest, daughters Elaine Rector and Bruce of Meadows of Dan, and Dr. Nancy Honeycutt of Saxapaha, eight grandchildren and eight great-grandchildren. In lieu of flowers, memorial contributions may be made to her church. Memorial services for John Harold Purdy are Monday from 3 to 5. Mike Moore Media is the first place to hear announcements from Perry Spencer, Fair, and Boone and Cook Funeral Homes.